Good morning. I'm in Copenhagen. Co Copenhagen. Copen. I can't. I still can't freaking say it. I've been here for like almost two weeks, but um, it's not that I haven't done anything exciting. I have. I've just been focusing on other videos and other things and getting settled. And I'm staying here for a month, the month of March, and then I had to do a border run. Oh, visa run actually. For now, I'm in Copenhagen. I live in a jungle. It's quite nice. Today I thought I'd film because I'm doing something exciting. I'm doing two things that are exciting. One is I'm going to do some litter picking on a beach. A Ko Ma beach in Copenhagen. I think it's like the north tip of Copenhagen. And uh, I have to go meet people soon and get a boat there. And then we're gonna clean the beach. And then afterwards, we're gonna go the second thing, going snorkeling. I've never gone snorkeling in my entire life. I'm excited, I wanna see what's underneath, you know, the sea, the oceans. And uh, I think we'll also do some like litter picking there as well. If we see like some, you know, plastic floating and stuff, like we'll pick it up, obviously, that's what good citizens of the world to do, you know? That is my mom and my dad oh. on the way. Hi. My mom donates the water for everyone today and the big water. Oh, thank you. Yes. From the boat now. And we're gonna go to Ka Ma Beach, Copenhagen, and do some litter picking. And uh, and then afterwards, go snorkeling. I'm exciting. Look at this. It's so crazy. Broken material in the stronger back, otherwise we mm. lose them again. Mm. Um, yeah, happy cleaning! Yay. Happy Yay. cleaning! Do <laughs> this. You see this tree? I have made this tree my mission. That is my trash bag. It is filled with a lot of rope that is tangled in here and straw plastic and shit. But um, I need a knife, so this lady is gonna give me a knife. And then I'm going to destroy this plastic. Litter pick update. Look at all this friggin' trash. We have a lot of help. A lot of people helping us today, help doing this. Look at this, this is absolutely, this is one beat. And we, we've all, we haven't even done it for a full hour, almost an hour. Isn't it disgusting? Yeah. Pick up after yourselves, people. Try to avoid plastic as much as possible. So this tree was my mission, I told you. <laughs> this big, like a giant uh, black trash bag full of rope and plastic. All of this was in this tree. This entire bag, full. How disgusting is that? And look at all these bottles. Absolutely disgusting. Get a reusable, get an algae, get a, uh, hydro flask, whatever you want, something BPA free if possible, and just refill it. It's totally unnecessary, you know? This is disgusting. All right, let's keep going. Go out, certificate. 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 I'm very disgusted, but at the same time, I feel like I really enjoyed doing it, so 
It's not that like I want there to be trash so I can pick it up, but I just it felt really good. I had like I was detangling the tree and I had the knife in my hand a lot. I was just like cutting it, just like it was like really invigorating and I really yeah. I have a lot of um appreciation for people who litter pick a lot, so I'm actually going to do a shout out right now. So I have a really awesome friend, Rohan, who actually lives in Kotat, which is like literally like we're practically neighbors. He's just like over there somewhere. I don't know how many months, it's been a few months he's been there and I think he started in Australia as well. Um, he's from the UK, but he visited there and started to just like clean beaches and now he does it I think every single day and at the end of the day he posts a picture on his Instagram called trash talk and he says how many bags what beach and like some people like helped him out and it's really freaking awesome you have to check out his Instagram I think he has YouTube but he doesn't make videos you need to make videos dude it's herb it all before and there's some dots in between but I'll link it below slash I'll write it across the screen he's just he he's one of the people who inspired me to do this I mean I would have done anyways it's like a group event in Copenhagen and there's about 18 of us right now and uh, we're actually gonna go snorkeling as well and if we see any you know plastic or anything we're gonna pick it up from inside the water so that's exciting never been snorkeling in my life but uh, check out Rohan's Instagram he's he's a pretty kick-ass dude oh my god we, we, can, we can sing one song together my 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 is open my, my mind is open, my mind, my mind is open. My mind is open, my mind, my mind is open. The tree won't let you love. And your fear is your downfall. Varieties of fishes, fishes, and schools of fish, and sea urchins, and this big clam thing, and and these like rainbow fishes, and they're like swimming all around me, and and coral, and colors, so much deeper than I imagine, and. I could like yeah. breathe at the same time, which is really trippy. And, like some people like went deeper and like I just like I didn't want to hold my breath. I just wanted to like float and like ah. Oh. oh my god. <sighs> the wonders of this world, I tell you. And one thing that just baffles my mind is that like I see this beauty and it's like why would anyone look at this stuff and want to take it out of the ocean? It makes no sense to me. <laughs> Let alone eat it. Oh, why? Oh my god! Where do I even begin? So I didn't film the snorkeling. You saw me afterwards. Um, two things that I've learned. One, sometimes you're gonna swallow a little bit of seawater. It's disgusting. Second of all, don't eat right before. Um, you saw the oatmeal that I made. I didn't, I ate around half of it, less than half actually. And immediately jumped in the water. I was like, I'm good, whatever. I was so good for like, I think we snorkeled was an hour, maybe half an hour, 40 minutes. And, um, I was feeling fine until the last 10 minutes and I was like, I'm gonna freaking puke in this sea. So I just got out, but I was fine. Um, I have a strong stomach. Good, solid as a rock. I feel great now. I am, um, afterwards, I said goodbye to everything. We loaded all the trash into the truck. I recommend you to watch Cowspiracy. Cleaning up and doing litter picks, it's so amazing. Like, do it. Do it and bring awareness to this. And, you know, the more people do it, the more people are less likely to, you know, hopefully leave it on the beach. Like, <sighs> Like how dumb do you have to be to like buy something and then just leave it there? Like who does that? Who does that? 
And there's so many alternatives. Buy your own water bottle. This earth is so beautiful. It's so beautiful. And we're destroying the fuck out of it. So please stop doing that. And I'm gonna shower because I'm disgusting and everything is salty. I'm salty and I'm sweaty. It is dinner time. Um, so I'm gonna give you a brief um, showing of what I eat. I'm having a giant salad. It has lettuce, cucumber, tomato, cilantro, green onion, uh, lentils. And I'm gonna have it with some steamed vegetables. Broccoli, uh, bok choy, and this other kale shit. And a dressing of just lime juice and Dijon mustard. Then I have one regular potato, one sweet potato baking. I'm going to eat all of this. It is an epic feast. I had my oatmeal, and yes, that's generally what I eat in a day. I have a big oatmeal with lots of fruit in it, berries typically, some mangoes sometimes, because they grow in Thailand, and bananas. And then sometimes I'll have a snack of maybe some sweet potatoes or, I don't know, something else. And then I have a big salad, sometimes with steamed greens, um, most of the time I do, sometimes, but most of the time with a legume, like bean or lentil, and potatoes. I don't normally eat anything after my, uh, my dinner. I'm normally full, but uh, today I just don't think I ate enough, <laughs> so I'm having two frozen bananas with a few frozen strawberries and water, and I'm just gonna drink this. I just published a video, and uh, yeah, drink this and pretty much <laughs> go to bed. <laughs> Food combining though. Okay, I'm ending the vlog now. Vlog's over.